Breaking news. Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, as well as some Southerners, Southwest particularly, has sent message to um, uh, Afeni Ferry asking, why will you want to form a new political party? When Tinubu, that is from the Southwest, is contesting the same election. Are you saying you have no credibility in him? Are you saying you are not endorsing this man? Or what exactly are we talking about here? Afeni Ferry has made an announcement yesterday that it will be forming its own political party. And um, many Nigerians have said, please don't make it a tribal party. Make it a national party so much so that um, people from all region and, um, you know, uh, will be able to join in this very quest and um, will be, you know, and be able to consolidate strength instead of forming small pockets of parties here and there. Why not us form one single a party that will be strong, that will be, you know, will be our party and we can unseat, you know, the people, the uh, all progressive Congress. This was exactly what the people, the uh, Democratic Party, what happened to them in 2015. Small pockets of party came together and unseat them because mm -hmm. of unity, the power of strength. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Let's get all the details. Sinobu has replied, Afeni Ferry, why will you form a new political party when I am from the Southwest contesting for the 2023 election? According to a report by Lead Nigeria, the debate on who succeed President Muhammad Buhari in 2023 has continued to generate reactions from the political party. Recently, uh, a pan-Yoruba social political organization, Alfeni Ferry, who is reacting to Tinubu's presidential ambition, declared that it will flaunt a new political party. We are going, we are still going to decide on whether we will take part or not in this very election, or we are forming a new political party, Alfeni Ferry has declared. Considering the, zo the zonal politics in Nigeria, many Nigerians will have to think that a social political group like that of Afeni Ferry will support their own to become the president of Nigeria in, in 2023. But such groups have their agenda that must be fulfilled. They have what they are creating and have created and the, what they think must work and so they are working hard towards achieving it to fit for nigeria therefore afeni ferry has the right to form a political party to pursue their own agenda if they so wish although tinubu was also part of the group before he had his own way tinubu as a political politician has his ambition which is working towards achieving the truth is that many nigerians have described tinubu as a man with good conscience they even said he was the father of modern progressive politics and made a lot of effort in, re in nationalizing progressive politics by internal and zoning of his work rather than other zones against him prevailing, preventing him from actualizing his dream. Tinubu is the closest to Awolowo today in terms of politics and strategy or whether Tinubu said Awolowo is a core cause for boring on how to lead. So Nigerians a lot, some are for and some are against. Uh, Fanny Ferry says it will be better for them to actualize their dream by following somebody they are not sure will give you know, prominence to what they want. So there you have it, my wonderful people. The call and the cry continues. Uh, Fanny Ferry wants to inaugurate a political party. Nigerians have called to say, why inaugurate, don't inaugurate a political party and call it a Yoruba party. If you do, you may not, it may not go down well. Mm. In the sense that then the uh, 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 conservative will say, we are forming our own. Or oh, Hanye in the will say they are forming their own. Why not come together, sit down, have a thought, look at it. What is our common goal and interest? And why do we want to form this political party? What has happened? And if you are able to come to a consensus and able to reach a, pl a platform, then you have covered all around the country. To become Nigerian's president, no sentiment, to be quite candid, is beyond just one region. 
if all Yorubas vote for you and not a single Igbo or Hausa vote for you, I beg your pardon, please check the constitution. You cannot rule Nigeria. Okay, there is a there is a minimum percentage requirement of acceptance according. That's why if you look at Americans' uh, election, you say uh, one person has this number, yet this person is not. No, there is a way the formula goes. Okay, so if you want to, if you want to uh, get the 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 what's it called now? The, the if you want to get everybody, you have to carry everybody along to a large extent. Yeah, you have to do much more than just me, myself, and I. Yeah, it has to be beyond that. So if Afeni Ferry is thinking of resuming a new political party, starting off a new one, the best bet would be include others. Get Northerners, you know, if you want to really take over power, let's, let's just not be sentimental for a minute and let's be objective. You need the Northerners to back you up. You need the Southeasterners to back you up. You need the South-South to back you up if you are from the Southwest vice versa whichever region you know why buhari and apc was able to succeed in 2015 i'll tell you what stinubu was from the southwest uh the likes of um uh what's it called now Uz uzokalu brought his own from the from the east the likes of uh, buhari himself from the north and i think one of that party they came together so it was not about me it was not about you and they all agreed together, okay, let us now put this person as our nominated candidate. Aha! Then you are talking. Now you are talking. Now you are talking. So you must bring others along. It's not about, uh, uh, I want to become the king. Okay? It's not about becoming the king. It's about inclusion. This is politics, I'm telling you. I'm not just talking about, I'm not just speaking sentimentally because I, I'm, I'm being, you know, no, no. I'm not just being, you know, I'm giving you the real th the real deal, how it works. Real life. This is real life. This is how it works. It's not about you having a group of people that share likes idea. You must be able to bring others along into the foods. I was able to bring them in and look at it and say, okay, what do we do? How do we achieve this together? There is a place called together. And when that name is being, is being amplified rather than I, then he exonerates and takes away that part of selfishness. And everybody begins to you know, climb the same tree and tangent in the sense that everybody comes off it and said, you know, it's not about me, it's about us. So what can we do? What do you bring to the table? What do I bring to the table? How can we achieve this aim and purpose together? What do we need to do? So that being said is how it moves.